And thank you. Tonight, a big payday for a South Florida truck driver who was attacked by NFL player Antonio Brown. A judge has ordered Brown to pay more than a million dollars for past and future damages, including upcoming surgery. CBS 4's Carly Barnett spoke to the victim tonight and joins us from the newsroom with what he had to say. Carly. Warren Elliott, well, getting to this point hasn't been easy, not just because of the physical injuries that the victim had to deal with, but as his attorney tells us, getting Antonio Brown to cooperate with any court proceedings was nearly impossible. This dash camera video recorded the moment Antonio Brown grabbed the driver of a moving truck. You see their reflection in the window, Brown's girlfriend yelling for him to stop. And little by little, he got aggravated. Anton Tumanov says he was making a delivery to the football player's home in Hollywood in January 2020, when he says Brown became upset that he still owed $4,000. He threw the rock at my window. Uh, luckily, it didn't hit the glass. It hit a little bit lower. Tumanov left and reported the incident to 911, but his company called and told him to go back because Brown's manager called and said he had calmed down. When he returned, Brown tried to grab the keys out of his hand. Uh, punched me several times in the back of the head, uh, then uh, tried to hit me my head against the wheel, and then uh, sh shake me and try to pull out from the truck. Tumanov said he had two herniated discs as a result. Mr. Brown ignored all the court pleadings, all the attempts at contact. Attorney Jeff Davis said he had to resort to serving him all the way in Atlanta after seeing a post on social media that he'd be at a club. Yes, sir. The case went to trial October 3rd. Brown never showed up, but Tumanov was awarded a verdict of $1.2 million. I think that that stands as just compensation for Mr. Tumanoff's injuries and damages, and hopefully Mr. Brown will realize that and honor his obligation to pay it. Brown was found liable for 407000 for Tumanoff's past and future medical expenses and 793000 for his pain and suffering. Live in the newsroom, Carly Barnett, CBS 4 News Tonight.